So this man, you don't need any introduction, Oliver. I guess everyone knows this man. He has been working so hard with the entire team to really make this possible. You've seen probably this face many, many times. I mean, in Hamburg, who doesn't know him? Um, I mean, um, other people in other cities might not know him, but uh, at least when you walk into a room and you have this hat on and then you're like two meter tall, then everyone knows that's Oliver, okay? So please give a very warm welcome for the host, Oliver Wrestling, and enjoy. Do you have also 12 minutes? Yay. Hi. Awesome that you all made it. Um, okay, I have another 12 minutes because stick to your rules, right? Thanks a lot, Carson. It was a really nice speech. Uh, oh, time is running. Um, the words you ended with, a positive approach when it comes to digitalization. Because it's a topic we're all dealing with, and that's the reason why we are here, and that's the reason why you are interested to come to this conference, because you are talking about this topic all the time. And we thought, at 12 minutes, we actually, at the end of the day, all it's about digitalization, or digital transformation and society. So we thought, if we do a conference, we have to use this broad topic, but break it down to what, is ac what it actually is. Just a short word about 12 minutes, where it all comes from. This guy is here today, too, and the girl, too, They're over there. So <laughs> um, this is a meetup. A lot of you already attended at one of our meetups. We are in like 30 cities all over the world and countries, whatever. We are one of the biggest meetups at the meetup itself platform. And there are more than 200 people working on that, voluntary. Look at the people with the red shirts. We call ourselves the Red Smurfs. So if, if you need anything, if you have a question, just ask someone with a red shirt. This person will, able, will be able to help you, I'm pretty sure. But thanks a lot for these 200 people. They made this possible, that this will happen today. <laughs> as Hannah already said, it's our escalated hobby. And um, as I already said, it's all about digitalization, digital transformation. But if you talk to 10 people, you will get nine different answers what digitization or digital transformation actually means or is. Some of them don't even are able to give you an answer. And that shows when you don't know what something is, everybody's talking about. Every, the news, it's full of digitalization. But if nine people have a different idea of that, it starts to confuse people. And when people are confused, they are Yeah, but with a high possibility, they might be a bit afraid of something. So there's a big need to have like a common sense of what, what's behind this digitalization thing. First of all, like from my view, it's two points. It's like something before, like in the 80s, we talked about the restructuring. Everybody was restructuring. When you ask somebody, what did you do in the company? Yeah, we are restructuring at the moment. We can't do that. Uh, whatever you want from me. Nowadays, they use the term, digit I, we, we do it in the digital transformation process. We do that all the time. And it's a lot of little, little, little parts that needs to be done to digitize. It's, 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 it's a process which will just never end in the next 20, whatever, to the next century, I don't know. But there's a business approach which is like a tech exponential pheno phenomenon. That's one approach. Just an example, let's talk about, I just took the example of robots and AI. There's a cute AI. Everybody knows this robot from the movies, yeah? And everybody thinks, oh, that's a cute robot. Then you have an impressive, impressive robots or AI. You think, oh, these robots can do cool things. I'm impressed. I can't do that. I'm afraid. <laughs> And there's a spooky AI. And they, oh, actually, I don't want that. That's a f f creepy AI. <laughs> we don't want that. So at the end of the day, we don't know. Do we like AI? AI is just one topic beneath the umbrella of digitalization. Do we like AI or do, don't we like AI? Is it black, white? Is it utopia or dystopia? The second approach is digital transformation as the next step after industrialization yeah so it's it's a, a society phenomenon everybody digital transformation touches the life of everyone who's standing here of everyone who's living in the city in this country at this planet 
that's how we actually this is the idea the, the really raw idea of digitalization uh, of industrial yeah and it changed a bit due to media and everything to this idea now we can work from all around the world and before we had to stand all next to each other um, and produce something and of course the reality is somewhere in between but we have to figure out so digitalization is not only technology it's the way how we communicate how we work how we live it might be it might be like confusing and you might feel, feel like a bit maniac about it or positive negative whatever we have to figure out as a whole as a society and that's something that's why we invited a lot of people here um, experts in digital they do they are actually the, the driving force of digitalization we have 80 experts talking to you about their work or what, what they do and what is the social component in this work what's their perception what's ethical components are in these works at five stages this is one stage we are outside we hope that the weather god is pleasant with us today let's see um, but there are another four stages inside so as soon as my clock is done i would i would ask you to jump in select the stage you want to participate in you'll find it online what's happening you'll find it inside everywhere printed so um, it's a really tough schedule so be in time wherever you want to go. We don't have time and we don't want you to waste your time. We have 80 talks. All the people are going to have a talk, which is like 12 minutes talk. Six minutes you can ask questions and another six minutes after the talks is break or sometimes even 12 minutes. You can see that in the agenda. And we're going to have 15 panels, which are 48 minutes since four people are participating and 12 minutes questions for you and another break that's how it's structured in the cafeteria you can do a bit networking we have like a one about two minute format for that you will figure that out pretty fast uh, pretty soon and we had a lot have a lot of breaks for you to have some food we don't have like a big break so you can kind of mingle whenever you want or not participate at a stage whenever you want and have a coffee we're gonna have awards and we're going to have the heaviest awards on this planet. Two awards, and you can really do like bodybuilding with them. Um, these two awards are a bit special. You can watch from different perspectives. Oh, my goodness. Um, and they are handmade, and they are six kilos each together. To microphone is out. Oh, OK. Um, 12 kilos together. and. Uh, it's a size of 12 centimeters each. So um, you see 12 is a thing we learned about where it's from. Um, now I was, ah, we have a party tonight. The awards is at 5.30. We have a party tonight at 9 p.m. at NoHo. So everybody who has a ticket, just be there. And uh, we're going to have a blast there. That's, yeah, that's a word. That's the agenda online. You'll find it inside everywhere. It looks really big and confusing, but just read it. It's pretty simple. It's always re uh, recurring. It's uh, the same structure all the time. So find your talks, find your panels, and you uh, ask your questions and be curious. And we're going to have the demo. You have some nice uh, signs here. So we invite the people who are here at the street to uh, participate at our demonstration. This stage is open for the demonstration, so there will be, here will be the 24 talks uh, during the day. And over there, there's a truck with an open mic. So if you want to say something, you just jump on the truck, you get like a, a megaphone, and then you can tell your ideas and your, 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 your fears, maybe. You can share it with the community. So these are our Without our partners, this won't be possible. Of course, this needs money to do something like that. And we have so many partners we already work with, and now we started working with, which really trust in our network, which really trust in what we do, and really believe that this crazy idea might work. So thank you <laughs> for being crazy yourself. <coughs> of course, we have a lot of network partners. We helped us that you all kind of found your way here. And if you have, we want you to have a positive attitude. It's the first time we have to, this conference, there will be a lot of mistakes. There will be some presentations that don't work. There will be whatever. 
if you're a speaker, just speak. You are the presentation. If something is missing, just find it. Just be in time. That's the only thing. Speakers and guests, be in time at the stage. That's fair for everyone. And if you have questions, the red smurfs, ask us. And please, don't all use the elevators. There are stairs. It's much faster because otherwise you are too many. Yeah? It's, it's curing. And yeah, I would like uh, to end with uh, Dave Marichano. Um, he said, great people talk about ideas. Average people talk about things. And small people talk about people. And I want us, and I say us, to be great people today and in future. So have a great, great conf uh, conference. I'm really proud that you all made it here. And let's have a blast. What, one more thing. At least during today and tomorrow, at least meet 12 new people you have never met. Okay? 120. 120. You can also do that. If you are up for a challenge, do 120. Enjoy your day. Please go inside. Find your stages. Find your stages and uh, we hope you enjoy.